You can you can show me how to do that. And I mean to make sure it's all filled. That's really great. So it's all covering the plate. Yes. Use a proper cup to add a small amount of food. So just a few little dots of each colour. So not too much. Like the yellow so just in the middle. Okay, that's enough. Yeah. And what other colours are you gonna do? Whatever you like. But not remember not too much colour. Only a cup of two drops. That's enough. Using a cotton bud dipped in soap, gently touch the surface of the milk and observe what happens. Right, sounds cool. Do you want to pick up the bud and hold it up to the camera so they can see what we're using? Ready when you are. <gasps> Whoa. We think of soap as quite ordinary, but it has some remarkable properties. It is made up of special molecules which have a hydrophilic, water loving head and a hydrophobic, water hating tail. These water hating tails bond with the fats, which are then held in the water by the water loving heads. When liquid soap is added to the milk with drops of food colouring, it reduces the surface tension of the milk and reacts with the fat. This interaction causes the fat particles in the milk to move and create swirls of colour. Thanks Thank for watching Science Ninja TV. TV. See you next time for more experiments.